So you know the New England Patriots coach, Bill Belichick, and he's uh, probably next to Vince Lombardi, the best football coach ever. So he is a friend of Donald Trump. So is Kraft, the guy who owns the Patriots. They're not buddies, but they're sympathetic to Trump, or they were. So Trump offers uh, Bill Belichick the Medal of Freedom, Presidential Medal of Freedom, a great honor. All right, you remember Rush Limbaugh got that a year ago uh, in the State of the Union. Um, and Belichick turned it down. So he's 68 years old, Belichick is. Why would he turn it down? Um, when Gary Player, the golfer, uh, Anika Sorenstam, uh, another golfer, Jim Jordan, a congressman, and Devin Nunez, a congressman, all four of them accepted the Medal of Honor um, this month. So why did Belichick turn it down? Here's why. In the National Football League, at this moment, there is a liberal philosophy, hard left, these are the people who run the league and many of the players and coaches. Not soft left, hard left. America is an evil country. We've gone through the kneeling and the standing business, all of that. That has taken root. So Belichick knows that if he did accept this award from Donald Trump, and this is fascinating, that he would alienate a lot of his own players and free agents. Those are players that teams offer contracts to, and the players can say yes or no. If Belichick is associated with Trump, more of those star players would say, I don't want to play for him. That's why he turned it down. And there's also a political component in Massachusetts. So both Senator Ed Markey, far, far left guy, and Congressman Jim McGovern, even further left than Markey, both said publicly, hey, Bill, you better not accept that Medal of Freedom from the president. You better not. It's a thinly veiled threat. And so did the Massachusetts Attorney General, Maura Healy, who basically doesn't enforce the law anymore. That's how far left she is. So Belichick is sitting there at Foxborough, where the Patriots are based, and he's going, hmm. <laughs> I, you know, I, I hate to laugh about it, but what I'm telling you is absolutely true. So he issues a statement, quote, subsequently, the tra tragic events of last week occurred and the decision has been made not to move forward with the award. Above all, I'm an American citizen with great reverence for our nation's values, freedom and democracy. Yeah. Somebody wrote that for him. Um, I don't know Belichick very well. I met him once or twice. Um, but it's a shame when you're offered a medal of freedom by the president of the United States and you can't take it because of politics.